What's good, honkies? Level-handed Agron. Welcome to Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Um, it's been a little bit since I've done some Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Um, I've been practicing a lot. Um, after I did this, um, I, I've kind of worn myself out of Marvel lately. For the most part, I don't know. It's more of a I, I get excited to play it in like once I put it in, but. Um, I've been playing the fudge out of this recently, um, so I thought I'd do some gameplays and whatnot. Um, yeah, so I, I basically have been doing nothing but training lately, um, just perfecting my team more so, um, working on meterless combos, um, for King, so King is not just a meter battery, or a... Not a meter battery, but a meter outlet. Um, making because essentially how my team is currently, uh, guy is my meter battery, and then king is my outlet, and that's a really good setup. Setup because um, I believe that there's enough hits done to where um, they don't realize that they've recovered in time, so you can get a free throw or two, uh, or two. I don't know how you would throw them twice. But, yeah, so, uh, steal some of that tech there, honkies, if you would like. Um, yeah, I've been practicing some other guy stuff, just, um, you know, things that are viable in which situations and what. Um, I need to work on guy tagging combos that lead to Bushinryu drops, or whatever, I can't remember the name of it. Um, because that is, like, his flat out most damaging like f finish to a combo period um yeah i was watching um oh what well, who was it um i think it was this flow eg flow i was watching him do some and uh they were doing a good chunk of fucking damage but yeah um i think what i'm gonna eventually do is actually strap on um two more um, meter gems onto King um, and then maybe go three meter gems on Guy. I like having the damage gems on King just because he has such a fucking hard hitting set of combos as is so you can bump them up to like 600 damage with a meter gem or two activated. Um, yeah, I, some of the some of the new combos that I, that was the single most perfect fucking timed raw tag ever. Oh Jesus. I might just go for a double knee rising knee there because in that situation I believe that rising knee chips um, and if it doesn't he's got to stand up to tag out. If he would have crouching light medium heavy or whatever link he wanted to do into a launcher to tag himself out he would have been safe but I think that, that was just a situation where he, he, you were so low on life that you panic. Um, but yeah, Mr. Biocross, uh, he's, a, he's a cool dude. Um, played with him quite a chunk last night. That King combo. God, I love King. Um, <laughs> I've been uh, practicing Lars and Dudley a bit. Um, I don't know. I To me, it feels... Meh. Um, they don't. That see, that's a sick setup. Um, you just kind of mash out a couple crouching lights, and then they expect you to follow up with a combo once you let them fall out of the crouching lights. Um, <coughs> they think that you've just dropped your combo, so they go to crouch block, and then you get a free um, command throw, low command throw, um, the half circle kick one. Um, yeah, it's real fucking handy. Um, you fuckers should try fucking using it. <laughs> um, so I've been thinking about it lately. Um, what do you guys want to see more of lately? Because I feel like I'm just doing like the same like three or four games. Um, do you guys want to see anything different? I mean, if you guys want me to keep doing just what I'm doing, let me know. Um, I don't know. I just do not know. Um, I'm at a loss. Um... I kind of want to do some more Anarchy Reigns, but I don't know how, I guess, populated the game is online anymore. Um, I 
If you don't know what Anarchy Reigns is, it's hype as fuck. Go watch some of my older Anarchy Reigns shit and you will understand why. <laughs> um, I will definitely be doing um, some Soul Calibur 5 again eventually. Um, it is just... I, I want to practice with it more. Um, more so because a lot of my older mix-ups are a little more difficult on stick right now because of my button positionings, but I really don't want to switch my button positionings because that they're just how I learned to play the game anyway. Um, so yeah, um, maybe if you guys would like to see some Bioshock Infinite on 1999 mode, we can do that. Um, I don't know. I just do not know what you guys would like. Um, leave some comments. Maybe I'll start live streaming soon. Speaking of live streaming, um, go ahead and go to the link. I'll, I'll put it in the description, and then it's also located on my channel's page. Um, go follow my live stream page. Um, I will be live streaming sooner or later, so if you guys would like to, you know, be informed on when I am live streaming, follow it. Um, essentially, um, I'm not sure what I will live stream for my first live stream yet, or when, um, but if you guys would like to see one relatively soon, let me fucking know. Um, I don't know if there will be a face cam or anything like that, but, um, I'm sure with time there could be one if you guys want, I don't know, I, I kind of think face cams are a little stupid, but, um, if you guys want to see a face cam in the corner or something while I'm doing it, I can do that. I mean, I won't object to it. I don't think that I'm a hideous creature or anything. Because, quite honestly, it should be a curse to look this fucking good. I just, uh, licked my finger and rubbed my eyebrow. You know. You gotta be kidding me. Bam, 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 bam. Um, you need to tech throws on Wake Up in the Corner because I almost always go for a throw when you're in the corner like that. Just because it's the unpredictable mix-up mix-up you don't expect a throw coming so I give you one um, I had a question the other day from Sierra say I'm gonna call you Sai because I don't your name always how, how it's pronounced and spelt always slips me in the moment and then I read it and then I'm like oh that's how anyway um, yes I will be doing some injustice demo I guess um, it'll literally be day one stuff I haven't played it really um, I played through this, the, the battle mode once, and, uh, that was about it. Um, yeah, I'll do one, I'll do a live session for it, um, I'll play through it once or twice or something, and, um, let you guys see what I think of it and whatnot, um, but when it does release, we will have a series fucking for that shit immediately, um, I will be maining either Bane or Deathstroke, I'm not sure yet, um, I... It's more than likely going to be Deathstroke, but, um, you know. Which, speaking of Deathstroke, if you guys don't know, this is a fun fact. Um, you guys might have heard it already, but oh well. Um, Deathstroke is actually who Deadpool is based off of, which is why their costumes look so similar, as well as their names are so similar, because... Deathstroke's name is Slade Wilson, which is also Slade from Teen Titans. Mind fucked if you didn't know. Um, they just changed. They just called him by his name because they felt that it was, you know, not a cool thing for younger kids. Um, anyways, it, his name is Slade Wilson. Deadpool's name is Wade Wilson, um, <laughs> which is why they both are so similar. And if you ever thought that. Deathstroke is ripped off of Deadpool, or vice versa. You are wrong. Deadpool was based off of Deathstroke as a joke, I believe. And then he kind of blew up because he was phenomenal and everybody loves everything about Deadpool. Um, <laughs> so yeah. Um, I'm a little disappointed, though, because I did pre-order Injustice God Among Us. God Among Us. Just one god. Um... Speaking of gods, the concept Superman is a terrible superhero. I don't care if you like him or not. He kind of just ruins everything fun about DC's superheroes. Like, you know what I mean? Like, he's just the superhero, the first superhero ever. 
so he gets every single superpower ever. But how fucking fair is that? What the fucking... Oh, you... I just have, you know, frost, breath, laser eyes, uh, super strength. Uh, I can fly around the world so fast that I reverse time. God fucking knows how the fuck that works. Uh, I can fly through the sun, or... Uh, you know, I'm only weak to, like, one thing, which is kryptonite, which there's a convenient fucking amount on Earth for some reason. Oh, fucking well. Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't like Superman. I don't like when he's in games. Um, I especially loved Superman 64, though. Best game ever invented. Um, probably should run for Game of the Year 2013. Uh, sarcasm, gentlemen. That's, uh, that's second nature to me. Oh, Jesus. Um, <laughs> oh, God. I, I honestly think, am convinced right now, before anybody has even watched the video, that... Somebody in the audience legitimately thought I was serious about Superman 64 for a minute. Anyways, um, just, he's just too everything. I mean, Doomsday is fucking sick. Doomsday just fucking kills Superman, I'm pretty sure, at one point. Um, speaking of Doomsday, I need to watch the animated show for that Batman and Superman Doomsday, I think it's called? I don't know. But it has Doomsday, and Doomsday is a bad motherfucker. He's just stone, or like some sort of crystal, I think. Um, I'm not too huge of a DC fan. I just know a lot about. Uh, not a lot, but I mean, a good enough amount about, um, you know, Bane and Batman and them. I, I, what I, as a younger kid, I was a huge Batman fan, so. But I, I was more so of a Marvel child than a Batman child. Um, yeah. So, anyways, like I was saying, uh, Superman just kind of makes everything not so fun because he's the first superhero, so he just gets everything, and he has no weakness. Um, so it's like, why, why are the other superheroes going to waste their time trying to fight him if they're just going to lose? Because he's the first superhero and is invincible to everything. <laughs> Except for Batman cool story about Batman that'll make you think he's even more fucking badass. One time, Batman had Green Arrow shoot a fucking cloud, an arrow that burst into a cloud of kryptonite dust into Superman. Superman breathed it in, and then Batman went up and beat the fucking shit out of Superman, and, like, he beat him to, like, the point of death, and then he just left him alive, and he was just like, you can just remember the, the day a mere mortal bested some, it was something fucking badass. I don't remember the exact phrasing because I haven't. I, I don't remember what it was from, but my friend Tony is a huge Batman fan and he was telling me about it, so. And, you know, injustice. Soon. <laughs> so, um, yeah. If you guys enjoyed the fucking shit and the stuff, um, follow my Twitch account. We will live stream maybe in this coming week. Um, not sure. Uh, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the Street Fighter Cross Tekken shit. I will definitely be doing more sooner or later. Um, I'm Lil on an Agron. Love you all, and peace out, Girl Scout. Subscribe or die.